Welcome to Heiko Machines Limited training video for the Sweepmaster B650 and B800. During this video, you will learn how to ensure the machine is ready for use and how to operate the machine, daily and weekly maintenance, and troubleshooting guides. Sweepmaster B650 and B800, working width from 50 centimeters to 87 centimeters, efficiency up to 4,350 square meters per hour, waste container volume 35 to 50 liters. To illustrate how to prepare the machine for work and operate the machine, this video will cover how to unplug the battery, an overview of the control panel, the importance of sweeping, and how to operate the machine. Before starting work, unplug the charger from the power supply and put it in the designated pocket. After turning the key, the battery discharge status will appear. The battery should be fully charged before starting work. Control panel overview for the Sweetmaster B800. There's a key to turn on the machine. Lever to lower the side brush. Steering wheel lockout knob. Driving stick. Parking brake lever. Lever to open the sweeping lid of the large garbage area. Filter shake lever. Unlocking lever of the waste container. The filter bypass. The Sweepmaster B650 control panel does not have a parking brake lever and a lever to open the sweeping lid of the large garbage area. This equipment is not needed due to the smaller dimensions of the machine. The sweeping process is not an additional element of cleaning, but the basis of the cleaning process. Before floor cleaning or washing can start, it's necessary to remove debris, both large and small, from the surface. Regardless of the choice of sweeping method, manual or machine, this operation is necessary before washing. Before you start cleaning, you should plan your route. Ideally, you should avoid narrow turns and driving over the same area of flooring. You should always try and keep a 10% overlap on your cleaning route. This will avoid leaving marks. To illustrate daily and weekly maintenance, this section of the video will cover how to remove and clean the filter, how to empty the waste container, how to clean the machine, how to charge the batteries, and how to change the brushes. Before cleaning the filter on the Sweepmaster B650 and B800, pull the filter shape lever several times. Open the main cover with the key provided with the machine. Loosen the locking screws. Remove the filter cover. Remove the filter. Gently tap the filter a few times to shake off the dust. Then vacuum it thoroughly. Return the clean filter, securing it with the cover and tightening with the safety screws. Close the main cover and lock it with the key. Remember, on all filters there is a mark indicating the correct up-down placement of the filter. The Sweepmaster B650 and B800 are equipped with a waste container located at the back of the machine. Unlock the container with the lever, pull it out of the holder, then empty it in a designated place.
wash the machine and all its parts regularly and thoroughly. Keeping the machine cleaned and well maintained will ensure a long life and the best possible levels of cleaning for your machine. After finishing sweeping, always connect the machine charger to the power source to charge the battery. When charging starts, a light will illuminate next to the control display. The main brushes and side brushes of the machine wear out during operation and should be replaced periodically. The side brush is mounted with three screws and its replacement requires the use of basic tools. The main brush is inside the machine. In both cases, the brushes should be replaced by the operator in accordance with the provided operating instructions with particular care. The next section in this video shows how to carry out troubleshooting the most frequent problems, including the machine does not turn on and the machine is not sweeping thoroughly. If the machine does not turn on when the key is turned, check that the battery is charged. If the sweeping effects are unsatisfactory, check the brushes for wear or adjust them. Open the main cover with the key provided with the machine. Adjust the side brush pressure with the knob located next to the brush. The adjustment of the sweeping brush's main sweep width is located under the cover of the machine. Use the knob to increase or decrease the sweeping width. Detailed information on brush adjustment can be found in the user manual. Following these recommendations will ensure trouble-free and effective work with Sweepmaster B650 and B800 machines. All information not included in the training video can be found in the user manual.